Trump also had his eye on real estate. He had looked all over Manhattan for the perfect location. And Donald came upon this site, which had the Bonwood Teller building on it. It was kind of a landmark building. It was next door to Tiffany's. He loved it. It was to be called Trump Tower, 58 stories of high-end retail and high-priced condominiums, a chance for Donald to finally surpass his father. To oversee the project, Trump surprised the construction world. He put a woman in charge. He said that I would be his representative and act sort of like a Donna Trump, he said, calling me a killer. I would be in charge of everything that, that would normally come to him. The men's world of unions and subcontractors in New York had never seen it before. Donald told me that he thought that men were better than women, especially in this field, but he said a good woman is better than 10 good men. I think he believed that women had to prove themselves more than men, so a good woman would work harder. Rez kept the contractors in line, and Executive Vice President Louise Sunshine handled the sales. He hired the right people to help him, myself being one of them. And we got the job done. 